Welcome to the morning update. I'm Erin Roan. The Aussies are continuing their winning run in the pool at the Commonwealth Games in Birmingham. Molly O'Callaghan taking an upset win in the 100 metre freestyle in front of Shana Jack and Emma McKeon, who took silver and bronze. She's told Seven she's stoked they all made the podium. Um, I'm really happy and I'm happy to do it alongside these amazing girls, especially Emma. Like, she's an absolute idol and stuff, so it's really nice to race alongside her this time. Disappointment for Brad Woodward. He was just one hundredth of a second from gold in the 200 metre backstroke. Earlier, Elizabeth Deckers took out the 200 metre butterfly final, while Nina Kennedy has won gold in the pole vault. To other news, all eyes on the Big Four to see which bank will move first to lift rates. It comes after the Reserve Bank moved for a fourth consecutive month, lifting the official cash rate by another half a percentage point. Unions say workers will be the hardest hit by ongoing rate hikes. ACTU Secretary Sally McManus says stalling wage growth means many have already rated the piggy bank. Same for casual workers. They don't have savings either. So there's a whole lot of Australian workers at the moment that have just no choice other than to cut back on everything but the bare essentials. A powerful cold front has moved across southern Australia with severe weather warnings in place. Meteorologist Dean Narimore says we could see some powerful winds whip through Melbourne and much of Victoria. Much of southern Australia is expected to see damaging winds with gusts up to 90 kilometres an hour. For some of our elevated areas in Victoria and southeast New South Wales, we could even see destructive winds up to 125 kilometres an hour. While northern New South Wales is bracing for more flooding, the Bureau has declared a negative Indian Ocean dipole is underway, meaning we are set to see above average rainfall across late winter and spring. Overseas, US House Speaker Nancy Pelosi has landed in Taiwan. It's the first such visit from a US official in 25 years. China isn't happy about it though, saying the US is playing with fire. A man's been charged, accused of breaking into Windsor Castle with a crossbow while the Queen was there. The 20-year-old forced his way in on Christmas Day last year with Her Majesty at home with Prince Charles, Camilla and other family members. And you might want to rethink that second steak. Research shows eating an extra portion of red meat daily increases the risk of heart disease by 22% due to the chemicals produced by the bacteria in our gut. To Sport Now, it's brought to you by Ladbrokes Mates Mode, the better way to chat, share and bet together. T's and C's apply. And remember, gamble responsibly. Call 1800 858 858. Australia remains on top of the medal table at the Com Games after another cracking day. We have 39 gold, 29 silver and 30 bronze. To NRL Broncos star Pat Carrigan has received a four-match ban for a hip-drop tackle that left the Tigers' Jackson Hastings with a broken leg. And Formula One team Alpine claims Aussie Oscar Piastri has been confirmed as one of their drivers for next season, but he insists he's not signed any contract. For even more sports news, make sure you check out the sports update. You'll find it wherever you're listening to this show. In entertainment news, and Dev Patel has broken up a knife fight in Adelaide, the Slumdog Millionaire star stepping in when a man and a woman came to blows outside a convenience store. And Demi Lovato has updated her pronouns. She's revealed she's adopting she and her again after coming out as non-binary in May last year. Last year, my energy was balanced so that when I was faced with the choice of walking into a bathroom and it said women and men, I didn't feel like there was a bathroom for me. I just felt like a human. Recently, I've been feeling more feminine That's on the Sprout podcast there. And that's the latest from the Nova Podcasts team. We'll see you later on for another episode of The Update.